So, hello everybody, this is Alchemisted. I haven't uploaded a video in a while. There is an awful lot going on uh, for me personally uh, that is just sort of draining me of sand as of late. Uh, there's a lot of family stuff that I'm not going to go into. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that I have no one but myself to blame. Uh, for instance, taking it upon myself to run mul uh, multiple, completely from the ground up, homebrews <laughs> uh, for a gaming group. That was probably a bad idea. The fact that I had two, not one, but two wisdom teeth putting me in essentially constant pain certainly didn't help matters when you added it all together uh, I basically had a lot of things I had to do not enough time in the day to do them I was in constant pain and it was for example for like Armored Core 6 uh, which I have ground in Armored Core 6 I have not progressed in Armored Core 6 uh, I am past you saw me practice against the spider I actually did get past the spider pre-nerf so you're going to see that. I'm probably just going to condense the footage that I have for Armor Core 6 into sort of like a rapid fire, like here's some of the stuff that happened videos, as opposed to just like a long progression type video where it's just me playing the game. Because um, my patience, my sanity, and my ability to react were all being compromised by the fact I have two fucking wisdom teeth putting me through a lot of pain and it shows it really does show my patience is zero and armored core particularly armored core 6 is a game that you really do need to have patience with mostly with yourself because the game is gonna kick your ass and i was absolutely not in the right mindset to play it i was actually expecting to put it off because I, I've been through this before with Armored Core 5 and Armored Core Verdict Day, uh, where, like, the re the game comes out and it's a and it's got, like, all kinds of bugs, and then the regulations come out and start fixing them. So, I've been through this already with those two games. So, I expected to put that off and play Starfield, but then Todd Howard decided that you don't get to play Starfield unless you've... Uh, unless he's sold X amount of graphics cards. So despite the fact that I'm fairly certain this machine would be able to run Starfield at least at medium settings, you're locked if you don't have like a certain, let's be, let's be, call it what it is, a certain dollar value of graphics card. So Armored Core 6 and Baldur's Gate 3, which is another game that I have that I've been waiting to start, uh, have really kind of become the standard bearers for the game industry the way it should be. So I'm really wanting to get back into Armored Core now that I can actually speak. <laughs> now that I can actually speak and not be in agony. 